All right, good day everyone. Welcome back. Today we're going to be playing this game. It's called Lethal Company. This was made by a man named Zekers, and he actually made a few Roblox horror games that I played a very long time ago, but not when I was making videos. Uh, there was one called like Silent Dark, which is like an OG Roblox horror game. I think that was back in like, what, 2016 or something? And uh, th those were very good games, but this is actually a Steam game. This is like probably the most fun game that I've played in 2023, no joke. This is super fun, it's $10. It's like a mixture of like a horror game and you have to like basically land on these moons with these buildings that have kind of a randomly generated interior and you have to like scavenge for stuff, uh, get money, sell it to this dude and then if you don't meet the quota in time, then, well, you get fired, and something very, very bad happens when you get fired. Uh, you'll see, because I'm inevitably gonna die, because I've only played this game for two hours, I play with my other friends. I'm gonna try it out in single player in this video, because I kinda wanna see what happens. But I'll probably play it again, we'll see. But yeah, I played this with some of my friends, and it's pretty fun but it's pretty difficult, and we're probably inevitably gonna die, so we'll see what happens. I'm just gonna get this started, friends only. And then there's some save files, confirm, there we go. Oh, okay, I'm waking up. Systems online. Yeah, this game, the graphics are really cool. It kinda reminds me of Borderlands, if you know what that game is. I don't know why, but it kinda does. Welcome to your first day on the job. Yay. This is your very own autopilot ship. Nice. You can sleep for the duration of your contract. Oh, cool. Oh my, dude, that is so dark. Um, but yeah, look, there's a profit quota right here, and you can... Shut up! I'm not... T I'm turning that damn speaker off. That thing's so annoying. Basically, I will explain. So, when you click... When you right-click, you can scan shit, and, uh, as you can see, it kind of, like, shows you how to use things, but uh, when we get into these buildings on these moons and these plants in general... Can I go out there? No. Uh, there's these items that you can look for and they're worth a certain amount of money, so you have to go get those from these buildings and these monsters will randomly spawn in at random times. And, uh, well, you gotta try and get it out here and you have three days to make $130 to start off with. So it's not that bad to start. Uh, but we're gonna figure this out. I actually never used the terminal. My friends were the one that were doing it. Pre please enter favorite animal. Um, dog. Please describe your role in a team dynamic. Um, terrorist. Okay. Welcome to the Fortune 9 OS, courtesy of the company. Type help for a list of commands. Uh, moons. Okay. Moons to see that. Store. We need to do store. I want to see if there's anything good. Walkie talkie. Those are really important because if you're using game chat and not uh, like Discord or something, you need to be able to communicate because uh, it's pretty difficult. And if you ever play this, you, you'll know why. Uh, pro flashlight, stun grenade, boom box. <laughs> what the? TZP inhaling. I don't know what that stuff does. We bought it last night and it all it does is just make your voice sound really high pitch. Zap gun, jetpack, extension ladder, radar booster. I think I'm gonna buy a professional flashlight. Uh professional whoa, what? Uh can I like the selection of ship decor rotates per quota. Oh. Okay, so I think I can do Pro F. Flashlight. Wait. Welcome to the company store. Use words, buy, and info on any item. Order tools in bulk by typing in a number. How the hell do you do this? A loud horn. A teleporter. An inverse teleporter. A selection of ship decor rotates. Romantic table. Pajama suit. Television. Shower. And cozy lights. You can get all this shit for your ship? That's cool. Okay. Pro... Uh... Flashlight? You have to do that little dash? Pro F... Flash... Light... Pro Flash... Oh my god, I missed the L. Okay. Yeah, confirm. 
There we go. Alright. So, now that I got that, I think that when we land, we will be able to... Here. When we land, there's a supply drop that drops down. And then you have to go up to it, and then open it, and then you'll get your shit that you bought. Okay, let's do moons. I just needed to explain that. This game's a little bit complex. Uh, experimentation, the company building. Oh. Okay, buying at 30%. Uh, welcome to the X Moons catalog to rotate, uh, to route the autopilot to a moon, use the word root. There was no action supplied. Oh, fuck you. Uh, okay. Moons. Let's see, Rend Eclipsed, Dine Eclipsed, Titan Foggy, Experimentation, Assurance, maybe I'll do Vow? Uh, confirm. Sure, why not? Your new balance is 35. Please enjoy your flashlight, thank you. I will very much enjoy my flashlight, alright. Uh, I should be able to open this soon. Or I think it auto-opens on its own, but I don't know. Man, I gotta get rich. I gotta try and make this place look nice. Apparently you can buy decor and stuff. Although I'm worried what happens if I get fired. Uh, alright, start game. Here we go. Boom. Very good. Okay, that was relatively easy to figure out, even though it was the first time I've done that on my own. Wow, yeah, you actually land. And you can open up the door and sit out here. So another thing is, is that... Hazard level C. I don't know what that means. I think it's probably relatively dangerous. Okay, 8 2 a.m. So there's this door right here. There's some times where these monsters will spawn in and you have to try and run into here. But if you close the door, its battery drains hella fast, which is kind of a problem. Uh, but it regenerates really quick, too. So you kind of got to escape pretty quickly if that's the case. Okay. When is that supply drop going to come down? Apparently it's a- Oh! Yo! It's coming! Oh wait, it's right here! <laughs> you like the beat? Pretty good music. Do -do 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 -do. Reminds me of the ice cream trucks that would come through your neighborhood. Oh boy. Alright. Perfect. Yeah, these also have a limited amount of battery though. So what you gotta do is you gotta come in here, and then, uh, put this in this little thing, charge item. Boom, and then that charges the flashlight, so you only want to use it when you get in the building. Okay, I think I'm gonna go this way. We gotta kinda look around for some lights for potentially an entrance to the, uh, well, the building, I guess. I don't really know what it is in specific. I think I did this map, like, one time last night. So I don't really remember it well. No, not one bit. Okay. Uh, well, this is going to be an issue. Because if I don't know what I'm doing, then I don't know how I'm supposed to get this stuff all the way back to base. What is that? Oh, okay. I think I see something up here. Right? What is this? Oh, I should not turn that on. Oh, look. Okay, so this is the building. I missed that bridge. I somehow took the more complex route of just going around it. Oh, down there. I gotta get down there. You can kind of, like, hug the wall and uh, get, fall down. It's pretty nice. There we go. Alright. Let's go in here. Yeah, this is unironically, like, actually the most fun game I've played this year. Wait, near activity detected? What does that mean? What the hell? It is so... It is so quiet. I don't know what near activity detected means. But it's probably not good. Oh, it's so quiet. It's so quiet. Okay, cash register. $115. Oh my. Okay. Alright, now what I gotta do 
Because I gotta figure out how to get out of here. I honestly... Okay, fire exit. Cool. So, I think I'm just gonna walk this back to base because... Uh, typically what you want to do is you just want to drop the stuff right there. But what I think I'm going to do is I'm going to bring this back. And then I'm going to call the day, probably. Because this is already like a third of my quota with one item. As long as I can get it back. But I also want to just get this back there as fast as possible. Because, if, as you can tell, I'm moving really slow. And I need to get this done because if an entity spawns in... I'll have to run into it, and then I won't be able to escape, so... This is gonna be very important. So, yeah. And it's already 1.28 p.m. Which isn't good. At all. It's getting dark, and I don't remember... Well, I know I came from down this way, I believe. Right? Okay, there's bees there. Actually, those are locusts. Oh, ship. Manticore. What is that thing? It's red, which means it's hostile, I think. And I'm glad that I did that. I'm gonna keep scanning. I don't like how close those locusts are to my base. I don't really remember if they're bad or okay. But I'm not taking any chances if I go near those. Um, I know if you steal, they have like bees nests or something like that. And if you rob them then the bees will kill you, like, instantly. So, you definitely don't want to go near those. Okay. Here we go. So, drop that there. Hell yeah. Cool. You can use the cash register. What? What? You can actually... Oh, that just does a little animation. Okay. So, yeah, we have 100 and... 100 and, uh, what is that, 15? Out of 130? Oh, that's basically my entire quota. Alright, you know what? I'm just gonna wrap this one up. Because I don't want to risk dying. So, yeah. What we're gonna do is we have three days. So we're gonna get out of here. And, uh, yeah. So I have two more chances to go get $15, which is absolutely nothing. I only have to get 15. That is super good. I just gotta get, like, one item, I think. Well, let's see if I can open this. Oh. Okay. There we go. Cool. Uh, performance. Notes. 115 out of 471. Okay. Employee rank. 2 XP. 2 days left to meet the profit quota. We're chillin', we're chillin'. All good, we're fine. Okay, I don't have anything in there, obviously, but... I mean, we literally basically already have enough. Am I able to go? Oh, land ship. There we go. Cool. Let's open. Alright, I think this is the same, uh, area. Celestial body, 56 vow, abandon, human rough terrain. Yeah, yeah. And I think the place gets more and more deadly the more that you revisit. Which is kind of why I gotta be a little bit cautious, and I should probably recharge my flashlight. That might be a good idea. Let me put this thing in the charger. There we go. Alright. Good. Okay. So... I think I'm gonna head down this way instead. Is there any beehives? That There's that manticall thing. Okay, I don't think it's... Harmful. I think it's just a bird. There's a bird, bruh. Yeah, birds are fine. I don't think it's that big of a deal. Okay. I want to go down this way. What is this? What is this thing? I see like a factory up there. I think... Oh, wait. I'm going this way again. Okay, I just gotta stick to the left. Right here. Main entrance. There we go. What is that thing up there? I swear I... There's like... Something on... Okay, that's just a tree. Bro. It's so hard to see anything. But I guess we're going in through the main entrance this time. And we'll just see what happens. Okay. I've had some times where I've come in here. Why is this like... Foggy? I... I don't know. But I've come in here and there's been turrets that just sit in the front entrance. 
and it is not good when that happens. So yeah, the best way to do this is just to right-click spam. You need to do that so you can scan for stuff, like entities, things like that. Thankfully, I've had no encounters, which I hope it stays that way. <laughs> Holy. Rubber ducky, 26. This is all I need. I could just leave, but I kind of... Oh my... Dude, that rubber ducky sound. I kind of do want to get a little bit more, because then I have some money that I can spend. You know? But also, greed is not a good idea, so it's probably going to lead... Yeah, this is a bad idea. I already know I'm going to die. I would keep going, but... <laughs> I thought I saw something moving. Holy, I don't know what, no, I'm tripping. But anyways, that's kind of the basics of the game. You just run in here, you look for stuff. If you get the profit uh, amount, then good. If you don't, then bad. So, just be careful about your flashlight. That's always another thing. Because this thing will die, and if it dies, then well, there's... What was that? There's certain entities that spawn in, and, uh, well, you can't really avoid them. Here. Where do I go? See, I'm already lost. What is this place? What? Where's the exit? Oh, there we go. Alright. Cool. So, we are over the profit amount that we need. And I think I'm just gonna run back. And, uh, well, I don't know, I guess I'm just gonna go sell to the creepy guy. There's a very weird planet that you have to go to. It's like on an oil rig, I think. And there's a guy there that you have to sell to, but you can't really see him because he is a little bit harmful. And he tries to kill you whenever you sell him stuff for some reason. So, eh, I guess I'll show you what happens. If it doesn't, you know, screw me over, then I will. But, anyways, we got the profit. There we go, 141, when I just need 130, so that was a really good match. Hell yeah. Alright, let's get out of here. I'm gonna start this up. Let's get out. And, uh, access terminal moons store. Um, how do I s go to the- oh wait. Where do I go to sell? Is there a way to warp there? See a list of wildlife. Okay. Get this out of my screen, please. I need to see... Okay, other storage, uh, bestiary. One day left- I know, I know. Store to see the company's selection. Moons to see the list of... Can I do moons? Uh, the experimentation, the company building. What is the company building? Oh. I don't know. Well, I don't know. Maybe I'll go get a little bit more stuff, because it seems like... Uh, I don't know. I, I'm just going to go get a little bit more money, because I want to be safe, because they don't buy it for exactly 100 and... Well, I don't know. It's like 77% or something, so I think I need to get a little bit more. I'm not going to do the math or anything, because that's boring, so... I'm just gonna go get a little bit more stuff, and then I think we go and automatically have to sell once we do that, but I guess we'll see. Let me charge this again. Good. Okay, cool. I wanna go down this way, and yeah, it should be getting pretty violent now. At this point, there's probably gonna be stuff that spawns in earlier, and I don't really uh, feel like having that happen to me. I don't want to die. I already basically have enough. But let's just go try and get a little bit more. I don't want to go through that main entrance, though. I've always gone through that fire exit because that place is just so much easier to navigate. I mean, that top area, I just, I go in the entrance and then I'm already not knowing what I'm supposed to do. So, yeah, let's just go down here. Plus, when I went down here, dude, I got that cash register and that thing was worth $115. I mean, dang. That's pretty good. Alright. Let's go right here. Fire exit. Yes. 
Good, good. Okay. Let me do that. Alright. Cool. Uh, I don't want to go in here. Yeah, it's a little bit random generated. At least I think. From what it seems like, it always seems like crap is just not the same whenever I go in. Wait a second. Ooh, magnifying glass. Well, that's worth a lot. Okay. Good. Is there anything else in here? Doesn't seem like it. Alright. Man, this is going pretty well. I don't want to jinx myself, though. That would be bad. I don't want to have something spawn in in front of me out of nowhere. That would be really unfortunate, wouldn't it? Hmm. Well? I don't know. Should I just leave? I mean, this thing's worth $45, I think. That's pretty good. I have no idea. I, I'm a bit worried that maybe it's not really enough. Well, let's just see. What is that? Okay. Whatever. What is that? What is that? Nope, I'm leaving. I just heard something. Oh, shit. Nope. I'm out. I'm out. I heard something. I'm... I'm out. I'm not doing this. No. I heard some crap. Where's the fire exit? How do I get out of here? Okay. Oh. This game is terrifying. I've gotten really lucky. I don't know what's going on this round, but... I haven't had, like, anything even try to attack me. Roaming locusts. Yeah, I think you want to stay away from those. I don't really know yet, though. I mean, as long as you don't go near them, I don't think they do anything. I don't think they're, like, out to get you. You know, which is kind of typical with bees and stuff like that, I think. Well, not really from my own experiences, but, you know. Okay. Ship. I really want to see if there's maybe, like, uh, a bee nest. Because those things are typically worth a lot, but they're super, super risky to get. They'll spawn in randomly around the map, but, uh, you have to, like, try and survive getting them, because, well, you know, the bees are defensive of their, their nest, so, yeah, alright. Here we go. That's 186. That is more than enough. Come on. We're fine. This is perfect. This is absolutely perfect. I'm fine, bro. Man. Alright, let's see what happens. I think that's it, right? It probably just puts me back in, uh... This planet again, or it sends me to the shop. I have no clue. I guess we'll see. Alright. 45 out of 457 dollars. See, if I had a bunch of people playing, I could get so much stuff. Zero days. Yeah, that's fine. I already have the profit quota, bro. To the company building immediately to sell your scrap metal and other goods. How do I do you that? Have zero days left to meet the profit quota. Okay. You can use the terminal to route the autopilot to the company building. Oh. Oh, okay. Moons? No, my. I just said moobs. <laughs> uh, the company building. Confirm. Oh, I could have done that. I'm dumb. Whatever, we're learning. We'll play this again another day for sure. This is way too fun. This is a really good game. Okay. Open up, boy. Oh wait, we gotta... I gotta land the ship. I'm still not great at the game, but I kinda know the basics, you know? Alright, here we are. This is like an oil rig or something. I don't know what this is. Alright, there we go. That little area right there. Hazard level safe. That's good. Alright, can I pick this up? Yes. These are our holy grails. This is exactly what I need. Let's go here. Alright. Sell item. Sell item. Sell item. Alright, ring-a-ding! 
Whoa. Okay. You don't want to go near it. Oh, my light just died. Um. Hey, man. Oh, okay. Yeah, if you, if you go near that... Here, let me put this in here and see if I... Whoa, paycheck. Your work is invaluable to the company? Okay, cool. I got money. I'm actually not going to do that because I don't know what happens if I die. I don't know if it resets the whole game or if, you know, something worse happens, but... Um... Hmm. Let me put this here. Alright. I'm going to probably store this. You know what? It's worth science. Why not? Let's see what happens. Access terminal. Let's go to the store now that I have some money. Walkie-talkie, flashlight, shovel, lock picker, uh, pro flashlight. I already have that. That thing's pretty useful, actually. 60% off, too. Stun grenade, boombox, uh, TZP inhalant, zap gun, jet pack. A jet pack? I didn't see that. What's a radar booster do? I honestly really don't know. Huh. What is bestiary? Uh, mantic oils and roaming locusts. Okay. Well, I don't know. I think I might just end it off here, maybe. I mean, we did one run. I was just kind of wanting to show what this game is like to start off with. Uh, give a basic rundown. And uh, I guess you can't save, so I don't know if this will save or not, but I guess we'll see. Uh, if I play this again, if you guys want me to play it again, let me know. I thought it was a pretty fun little game, I'm not gonna lie. This is $10, too, for this good of a game. And it's on Steam. I like the graphics. I really just like the whole premise about it. It's very unique. I've never played something like this, at least recently. So, yeah. That is this game. It's pretty damn good. Very good. Lethal Company W. Good game. And yeah, if you want me to play it again, let me know. Drop a comment and a like and a subscription if you enjoyed. I'll see you in the next one, which should be tomorrow, hopefully. Uh, we'll see. I've been kind of busy, but I don't know. All right, well, I'm going to call it off. Uh, take care and see you in the next one. Bye.